Hello everybody, thank you for joining me once again. So, today's topic is about music. I mean, how can you learn English using songs? Have you ever thought about it? So I'm going to suggest you a process that you can use to learn the English language in a very fun way. So let's go with it. Well, first of all, I need to say that this is a process I used when I was in the beginning of my journey, all right, when I was studying English at the beginning, at the very beginning. Today, I still use it, but it's not that often. So, the process is very simple to understand. Pay attention. I'm going to say some of the steps you are supposed to follow. Okay, I'm going to tell you all the steps you are supposed to follow in order to take advantage of this strategy to learn the English language in a more dynamic and nicer way. Alright? So here we go. The first step. You have to choose a song. Of course, you have to choose any song. So, I would suggest you to choose a song that you really like. Or at least you know the singer, you know the artist and you like the artist so that is my suggestion to you because if you take a song you don't like it's gonna be a very boring process so choose a song you like and at the beginning I would suggest you to pick a song which is slow right which is not very noisy lots of instruments it will I mean it will be easier for you to understand it if you start like this. Of course, if you want to challenge yourself a bit more, you can choose any song, but my suggestion for the beginning is slow music, all right? The second step, listen to the music. Of course, you have to listen to it. So it's gonna be like this. You have to listen to the song three times, only listen to it, only listen to the song you chose in order to try to understand it as much as you can. Okay, try to really, really get the meaning of the words. Try to really understand what the singer is singing. All right. So this is the first, the second step. All right. You, I, I, I recommend you to listen to the song three times. Okay, three times would be perfect. All right. The next step, the third one, will be. Listen to the song again, but you have to read it. You have to read the song lyrics while you are listening to it. Because this will be a moment for you to check if you, what you heard previously was correct. Okay, this is the moment when you're going to see, oh, that is what the singer is saying. So yeah, this one I think I misunderstood here, but here it's perfect. I really, really got the meaning of it. So. That is the third step. Listen to the song while you read it. While you read the song lyrics. Okay? Alright, the fourth step. Only read it. Only read the song lyrics. Okay, this is the moment when you are going to really study the music, the vocabulary. If there is any word you don't know, you can just underline it, circle, highlight. So you just circle all the words you don't know you have never seen before so it will be nice for you to learn those new words okay to for you to learn those new words it will be nice if you really underline it and research it but of course a music has a context has a meaning so if you can deduce the meaning of those words you didn't know it's better. Try to deduce it. But if you want to make sure, you can go on, a, on the internet or, or even on a dictionary, normal dictionary, to search for the words, okay, and to really see the meaning of them. Alright, so that is the fourth step. Read the song lyrics five times. Just read it. You're going to really get used to the words, to the meaning of the song, to the song itself. Right? Afterwards, okay, the fifth step, you just have to listen to the song again, but no papers, okay, no 
song lyrics, okay? Just listen to it because you have already studied this song, so probably you will understand a lot more, maybe everything, you know, you will understand the whole song probably. So this is only for you to reinforce the song you have been studying, right? And the last but not least step is you just have to sing it. Of course you have to sing the song, you have to pronounce the words, you have to really really sing it, alright? Of course you don't have to be a great singer, you don't have to be an opera singer or something like that, but you have to sing it, okay? Just sing the song, it's gonna be really helpful. Alright, so this process, again, let's kind of, you know, organize the ideas better. First step, choose a song. Second step, listen to it. Third step, listen and read the song lyrics. Fourth step, just read it. Just read the song lyrics. Fifth step, listen again. And the last one, the sixth, just sing it. So this is a process, alright? This is a process that you can use to learn English using songs, right? It's a very nice way of learning. I really enjoyed when I was studying, you know, I really enjoyed doing that. But I have to admit, it's kind of hard work, you know, it's kind of... Uh, it can be a tiring activity for you to do very frequently. You know, it can be boring, you can start getting exhausted and etc. So I recommend you to do it once a week. Not every day, especially because you cannot learn properly a new song every day it's gonna be a mess probably it's gonna be confused at least it would be to me i don't know if it would be the same to you but to me it would be very confusing you know to learn a new music every day so try to do it once a week all right so this is a process that after you finish the process you will have practiced your listening skill, of course, you will have practiced your reading skill, you will have practiced your pronunciation, because you will sing it and you will read it, try to read it out loud, okay? You will have practiced um, grammar structures, you know, even if you don't really pay attention to the grammar in the, in the song lyrics, it will be there, so you will get in touch grammar and also you will have learned new words okay you will have learned new expressions new I mean new ways of saying things okay so it's a process that kind of deals with most of the things you need to be in touch with to learn the English the English language will be there through this process so just try just give it a try alright and it might help you okay so that's it for today, okay? Pay attention to the description box because I will recommend you a website that you can use to study English with music. Alright, and also I will recommend you a website where you can take the song lyrics from and also I will recommend some songs, you know, some... I will try to create a playlist for you to study those songs I will recommend you once a week, every week, alright? So just pay attention to the description box. And to finish, I just have to thank you again, alright? For everything you have said to me, for all the comments, for all the good, um, to know, the good feedback you have given me. Also, for commenting on my videos, for giving me some thumbs up, for subscribing to the channel, okay? It means a lot and I really appreciate it, okay? And I would like you, please, if you have any suggestion, just comment below, just leave a comment. Oh, I would like to see a video about this. Just leave a comment, I'll try to make it, all right? So thank you very much, mates. I really appreciate, okay? All, all, I mean, everything you have done, and thank you very much for watching this video specifically, all right? See you, bye-bye, and have a nice day. <laughs>